So in this video we will be learning how we can make minimap like GTA. As you remember we have created minimap before but that was not too good. So I decided to make a new minimap like GTA. So if you are new on this channel just go ahead and subscribe this channel right now and press the bell icon to get latest updates. So without wasting any more time let's get started. So I have opened the scene right now and let's make the minimap right now. So we have to change, uh, choose the position which uh, position will look more cool for the minimap. As you can see there are uh, we cannot make minimap on the top left uh, top right corner because uh, we will use multiple options in the future in uh, top right corner so we have to make it on the top left. So let's do it right now by right clicking over here and then click on UI then click on raw image here so let's call it mini map yeah mini map all right so i already have created so i have to delete this right now and let me delete the stuff what i have created so yeah let's call this mini map and change its position from here just hold the alt button and click over here and then click on here that's great okay just come to the position and make it a little bit big move backward and drag and drop it a little bit down here it is looking cool so yeah let's make it more awesome so what we need to do just go ahead and make a new camera which will show everything what is happening in the game world so to do that just go in your player and right click over here and then go to your uh, create a new camera over here all right double click on your camera and come out from the 2d position and change the camera position x to 90 sorry rotation you have to change the camera rotation and make x to 90 and move it in uh, y position yeah so it's all uh, up to your taste uh, where you like the position of this camera so i like this position from uh, over here i think uh, here it is looking more cool all right so yeah so let's test the camera oh sorry we have to create a render texture to show all the stuff in here this raw image so to do that just right click over here and click on create and then click on uh, render texture here it is and called it mini render uh, whatever all right so yeah let's drag and drop this mini render texture to here click on minimap raw image and drag and drop this mini render texture to here texture field all right so as you can see everything is working properly and you cannot see i think in here because it become empty so what is going wrong so what we need to do just go ahead and click on camera and drag and drop this render texture to this target texture and voila you can see uh, the minimap is ready to use but it is not completely completed yet because we have to improve it more and more so because uh, before improving it more and more just let's test this render texture minimap how it looks like so all right the game has been played and let's test this right now by yeah wow it's working like we can move around and our minimap is moving with us that's awesome but now we have to improve something like we have to show our player in minimap like a, like a triangle as we see in y city or gta 5 so we have to do something like that so to do that just come out from the playing mode and go to window then package manager all right so it has been opened all right so what you need to do just go ahead and in unity registry you have to install this package in your case you will see the install button over here so just click over here and then click on install it will take uh, i think more than three or four minutes or five minutes not more it all depend on your computer speed all right so after installing this package uh, what you need to do just cut the package manager and click on your player right click then click 2d then sprites and choose the triangle all right the triangle will appear in the legs of your player and then you have to move it a little bit up and in x rotation you have to write the 90 and then uh, see the camera look uh, position on y just copy that and paste it over here here then you can see the camera and the triangle have same position so what you need to do just drag and drop little bit down um, over here something like that and make it a little bit smaller and the other thing you have to do is just click on camera 
and then select skybox and choose solid color and then here you have to select orthographic instead of perspective all right so in this case you have to make triangle a little bit more big more 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 and drag and drop a little bit down here it is looking more awesome no we have to make it a little bit more small something like this so yeah that's awesome and i think we can change the color of this uh, triangle i want to do this with green yeah it's, no should be it's all up to your taste what kind of color you want i think it should be yellow or something like this so yeah my player is yellow Okay, let's test this thing right so let's test this oh wow it's working that's pretty awesome so yeah let's improve our minimap a little bit more and how can we do that just adding some corner points to our minimap and then adding post processing so it will look more awesome so in UI you have to double click on your minimap here and then right click over here then create a new raw image and drag and drop it over the minimap backside the minimap and then drag and drop minimap inside the raw image all right and call it mini bg yeah uh, it means mini background all right so let's drag and drag out the minimap and then make it a little bit big something like this all right here it is looking more cool and then drag and drop it inside the mini background it's too big so we have to make it a little bit small according to the taste of our game so how it is looking like i think it is a little bit cool and let's make it black i think it is looking cool but it's all up to you what kind of color of corner you want i think it is the black one is cool or let's try other colors like yellow green or something i think this one is looking better than other ones all right so drag and drop your minimap in mini bg okay yeah so again in window back in manager because we have to go to install the post processing because we will add a little bit post processing in our minimap to make it a little bit more cool search for post processing and i already have installed so in your case you will uh, see the install button over here and you have to click on install all right so it may take five minutes or it's all up to your computer speed after doing that what you need to do you have to right click over here then create empty then click uh, right post processing or something else and then add component here search for volume then select post processing volume all right then click on global click new and in layers in layer section you have to make a new layer something like this i already have created with the name of post in your case you will see this uh, empty so you have to write post processing you can also add a layer it's all up to you what kind of name you want to add so i uh, i added post processing layer here you what you need to do just select the post processing layer and in minimap camera here you have to select the post processing layer and then select post processing as you know we are making the game for mobile phone so we need the fast mode here you have to select the fast and click on the fast mode all right so now we have to add some effects also click or uh, add the layer of post processing yeah in post processing we have to add some effects so what kind of effects will look good in our minimap so let's try with this effect the last one being t effect so i don't think it will look cool so yeah it is looking awesome so we have to make a little bit more uh, you know the brighty so to do that we ha we can choose auto exposure and here we can I think we should remove this and come to grain or color grading here we can add many things like yeah here we can control the temperature like it will look yellow if you will increase the uh, temperature and it will look blue if we will decrease the temperature something like this so i think it is looking good in blue one and here we can increase the exposure like brightness right so 
Wow, this is looking very awesome. It is not looking a little bit cool because I am not satisfied with this. So what we need to do just click over here and then click on camera and then click on not anti-aliasing and here so I was testing a little bit. So in temperature we have to increase a little bit temperature from here. Yeah, it is looking so cool right now better than the previous one and control the tint and I think it was good here so yeah our mini map is ready to use and we can assign different signs to different things like we can assign the signs to cars and the buildings in the same way as we assign the sign to our player thanks for watching and if you have any kind of question you can ask me on instagram or just comment down below and if you have enjoyed the video just hit the like button and if you want to get more videos like this so just subscribe now